We are ready to begin the third and final period of this quarterfinal game. It is five nothing in favor of Blood Red over the Triple Deets. Two goals by Tommy, two by Steve, one by Morris, and there's the hat trick. Right off of the opening faceoff. Beautiful passing gets it to Steve. He is able to put home his third. It is six nothing. With a 6 0 score less than a minute into the third period, Blood Red completely in control right now. Call field the hat trick. Plays it back to Numa. Kept in by Ben. Nobody is there. Tom tips it away, gets it to Steve. Steve playing it up the side. Honorbond now looking for Boris. That's onside. Boris now controlling the offense for Blood Red. Can he add his name to the multi goal club? No, knocked away by Roderick. Played back to Boris. Boris now only as far as Mike. Mike able to bring it forward. He has no help though. Knocked away by Numa. Now Steve the other way. Trying to get around Lynn. Stuck up in the benches. He's able to do so. We got a three on two here for Blood Red. Steve's going to take himself past in the last second. That is. What's the ruling? That went in. That is the call. Uh, according to our match official, that ball went into the net and bounced out hard. Honorbound with the goal to make it 7 0. Well, now off the face off, Honorbound going to take another shot. Pass it off to the side. There is Jonas with the ball. Played in the corner, Jonas able to get it out. Plays in front to Phil, unable to get it anywhere. Back to Jonas in the corner. He's got Honorbond in front. There's a shot. That one is off the post and out. Then makes the clearance now. Looking, looking. Plays it forward, gets it past everybody, unfortunately. And Jonas recovers in the defensive zone. Jonas to Honorbond. He's got Phil helping him out. Everybody recovers. Lynn gets it away in the corner. Now there's a fight in the corner. Who's going to get there first? It appears to be Blood Red able to do it. Honorbond has it, but he can't get a shot off. And he goes into the opposite corner where Honorbond will fish it out. Now he and Mike fighting for it. This ball gets away and rolls down to the other zone. Nobody helping out for the Triple Deeks. Jonas is able to control with ease. Putting it forward to Honorbond. Up to Boris. Gets a pass. Phil too far. And in the corner we go. Now in the front. Jonas unable to get anywhere. He tries to play it forward only as far as Numa. Back to Honorbond in the middle. He's going to lift it. Unable to get it to a teammate. Now Lynn has a chance. Strike one. Gets it only as far as Numa. In the corner now. Numa plays it into the defensive zone. Other way we go. Then we'll slowly walk, sorry, that Simon will slowly walk this one up. Can't get it to Kristen on the side. It is Jonas bringing it up instead. Trying to get around to Kristen, unable to do so. This is a very interesting matchup here. You have an offensive player playing defense, defensive player playing offense, and the result is a bit of a stalemate. Jonas looking for the cross, but Red jumps the gun. They have to bring it back. Leaves it to Phil. Phil is able to bring it around. He's being guarded by Mike. Can he get it around Mike? If he does, they've got a chance. It's it as far as Honorbon. Honey knocks it away. It's to Jonas. Honorbon right in front. He's going to get a shot. That's saved by Roderick. Clear is blocked by Phil to Jonas. Jonas gets it to Phil, trying to reward the man. That shot is tipped away by Honey. Now Honorbon controls it. Leaves it back to the edge of the zone, but only as far as Mike. Now Mike can have a shot if he wants to. Gets it around Numa. Can't get it around Honorbon. Chaos in the corner here. But it is Honorbond coming out with it. Oh, and Ben with a steal. Mike with a shot saved by Tom. Another wonderful save. And it will be Jonas bringing this one out of the back net. Plays it forward, but only as far as Mike. He's going to take a shot. That one is a wild shot. Unable to get anywhere. It's a fight for it. Ball gets away from everybody. Ben now has it, trying to play it forward. Nobody there. Honey controls it at center, throws it back in, but only as far as Honorbond can't get it to Mike. Honorbond now bringing it forward, looking for Nandor. No, he's going to take the shot himself and a save by Roderick. 
Vandor on the corner, passes it to the middle, can't get it to Tommy. Nobody is there for the Triple Deeks to start the break the other way, so instead Honorbon gets there first. Tommy tips it back to Honorbon. Into the middle, no, this gets away from everybody, Roderick will fall on it. We have nine minutes, 45 seconds left here in the game. It is a 7-0 score in favor of Blood Red, the top seed, absolutely dominant today. Andor wins the face off, controls it, gets it to Tommy. Fun begins over to Boris. He's going to take a shot. That's a save by Roderick. Back the other way. Tom is able to control it. Tommy can't do so. Now Ben with a shot. That one is easily tipped away. Linda blocks the clearance. Chaos continues. Tommy can't fall on it. Numa's able to get the clear. Andor the other way. Boris has a chance at a breakaway. He goes in. He shoots. He scores. After what looked like a good chance for the Triple Deeks, it was cleared up to Boris, who had beaten the last defender. One on one, able to get it past Roderick. That is his second. It is eight, nothing. With eight minutes, 45 seconds left here in the game, the score has ballooned to 8-0 in favor of Blood Red. Now Tommy trying to make it nine, passes to the middle. He's got Nandor, that's a shot. That's a save by Roderick. Now Tommy plays it to the center, can't do it. Money playing it around. Tries again, this one instead to Tommy, he's gonna take a chance. Passes it off to Boris, that's a shot and that is falling on by Roderick, will have a face off. This one cleared by Nandor to Tommy, that shot goes wide. Behind the net, Honey is there first. Plays it into the corner where Nandor will get there first. You can see team members of the Snake Eyes in brown warming up for their second game. The final quarterfinal will pick the number seven Snake Eyes against the number two goal. And Nandor playing it, but can't get it to anybody. Boris instead controls it. Boris with two goals already. Lots of scoring in this game for Blood Red. It's all for the same few shooters. Now Boris to Tommy. Can he get the hat trick? No, saved by Roderick. He's leading to the corner. Yeah. Lynn trying to play it around, only gets it stuck in the corner. Trying to get past Tommy and Nandor. Just double team, not able to do it. Nandor has it behind the net, plays it into the middle. Nobody is there. So it goes back the other way. Now all of a sudden, Mike races to the ball first. Nobody's able to help him. Numa clears it. As far as Simon, now Tommy trying to get away. It's DeBoris, but Lynn is there. Mike with his shot goes wide. DeBoris recovers in the net. He's going to bring it out. Goes up to Nandor, who's able to tip it away. Nandor controls the tip, playing it forward. Oh, Simon can't keep it in. Instead, it's Tommy. He's going to pass to DeBoris. Nobody's there. Uh, that was nearly nine. DeBoris back the other way. Now looking to get a chance. This one will be fallen on by Roderick. Move the face off. A very clean game so far. I don't think there have been any power plays yet, which is a testament to how these two teams have decided to play a clean and crisp game. Scott already on a hat trick, passes in front to Jonas. That's a go. Scott takes the face off, plays it slightly behind the net, finds Jonas charging into the middle. Perfect layoff. And that is Jonas's first goal of the game. He joins the score sheet. It is 9 0. We have about six minutes left in the game. Ball goes back, trying to play it up. Jonas now looking for a teammate. He's got Scott. Scott playing it back. There's the sh that shot goes wide. Jonas back to Ant, swing and a miss. Wide open, but Tom's able to get there first. Can he lift it around Mike? No, he can't. Wide open net, but Ben is unable to get there to control it. Now back the other way, Steve playing it up to Jonas. Ruff says everything is clear. Jonas into the middle. Block first, block second. Third try, he's got two men on him. He's able to clear it up to Ann. Ann will take a shot, that one goes wide. Ball takes a few hops, goes to Jonas right in front, shot and save. Nobody can get the rebound. Roderick unable to fall on it. Steve tries that one is covered. We will have a face off. Woo. Uh, 
five minutes, under five. We are under five minutes left in the game now. Men and Scott will take the face off. This one is won by Blood Red. Phil trying to play it back, but Scott can't do so. Jonas has it instead, can't find Phil. This one goes into the corner. Phil was there first. Plays it behind the net to Jonas. Jonas now looking for a teammate, trying to get around Honey's defense. Gets it to Ann. Ann will shoot. That ball is tipped away. And Ann is unable to control it. Goes all the way back to Tom and goal. That one's partially blocked by Ann, but Tom is able to get another clearance. Now Phil up, looking for Jonas. Covered by Honey. Steve now looking. Cleared away by Roderick and goal. This ball goes out. Blood Red will have to reset. And looks to get it around. Mike does so to Steve. Ball bounces off of Phil's foot. Unfortunate because Jonas probably had a break. Phil into the middle. Can't find anyone. This one goes out again. Now into the corner. Unable to control. Tom plays it up to Phil. He, I'm sorry, up to Steve who has Phil on his right. He's taking a lead off to the left. Jonas, Jonas to Phil. That's a save by Ryder. Rebound goes wide. Joyce recovers Steve with a shot that goes high of the net. Now recovered by Phil. He's going to play it in the middle there. Steve, that shot goes wide as well. Steve chases it down. No, he's not going to give up on this one. Plays up to Jonas. Can't get anywhere. Phil has it instead. Now it is Phil and Grissom fighting for in the corner. Gets it to Jonas. Jonas hanging around. And Mike is able to knock it away. If he hurries, he can do something with it. He's got Ben in the middle. Mike with the pass, tipped away by Tom. Now back the other way, it is a two on one. Steve plays to Phil, Phil with the shot. That is a save by Roderick. Is he on it? He is, that's gonna lead to a face off. Phil has had a few chances here, just unable to get past Roderick. Uh, this is one of those footnotes in this game, unfortunately, as at a 9-0 lead, it looks like Blood Red will cruise into the semifinal. In the semifinal, Blood Red will play Pravda, assuming that Gold defeats Snake Eyes in the next round. If Snake Eyes wins as the lowest remaining seed, they would get Blood Red instead. Played to Ann at center. It's knocked away. Now, Ann will try again to get it to Honor Bond, does so. Caught in the middle of the line change for the Deeks. But, Aaron pass, and Lynn will be able to control in the corner. Or in the bench, I should say. And plays it up, but only as far as Boris. Boris Honorbond, he's going to go for a shot. That's saved by Roderick. Tip the side into the bench. Cleared by Lynn. We're going the other way. <laughs> Boris now. Laying it up. Has Honorbond all alone. Honorbond has Nandor for some help. Finds him. Is this going to be 10? No. Tipped away by the defense. Ball rolls into the corner now. It is still in, and Ann is going to. Oh, Ann loses it out. Boris will recover instead. Playing it up, looking for a teammate. He's going to bring it himself. Taken away by Simon, and Lynn will play it into the, into the net side. Red ball, red ball. My ball. And gets it first up the side. There's Honey with a shot that is tipped by Simon and tipped wide, unfortunately. Now Kristen playing forward in the corner. And or forces the pass to go wide back into the net. And Lynn will get there first for the Triple Deeks. Nobody waiting on the other side. Nandor will recover easily. Trying to get around his man. We have a pull goalie now for the Triple Deeks as they're just going to try and go all out here. Honorbound hoping to tip that one in. He does, and it's 10-0. Really not much that the Triple Deeks can do at this point. Had to have everybody out there doing their best to try and get a goal. Get caught on the break. Honorbond with his second. It is 10-0. We have less than a minute left. The goal, the goal remains empty for Triple Deeks, and their score sheet remains empty as well. Now playing it in the middle, Nandor trying his best. Plays it up to Honorbond. Can Honorbond get the hat trick? No, tipped away, and Lynn will force it in the back. Been a dominant performance thus far by Blood Red. Now Boris has it. Has it knocked away. And up to Boris. This one goes to Honor Bond, and he's going to try and slot it home, but tipped away by Honey. Ball goes back, and it's going to roll out as Ann unable to get there in time. The chase is on. She's going to dump this off to the side where Boris gets there first. Boris trying to bring it around Ben, and he's going to shoot wide. At this point, that doesn't really matter. 
And that is the game. Blood Red with a dominant performance, a hat trick by Steve, two goals by three different players, 10-0.